<coughs> what up? I just wanted to address something to Miss Sexy Lat sixty nine. If you haven't noticed the video hatred that you put on me, you have gotten zero views on each one. Either that means that nobody likes you, or they just don't give a fuck what you have to say about me. Um, but when I post a video, say, right now, I'm going to get views up the ass, I'm sure. Why? Because the BWC respects me, the trolls respect me, and YouTubers respect me, as well as Juggalos. I am respected, and I learned it from Blue. Blue taught me this. Blue said, don't make any enemies. So I asked him, well, why you got BWC and your fucking friends list? He says, just keep them there, dude. Alright. I, I have lots of resources. I'm happy for that. But you, you are not getting any views. The only suggestion I can make to you is pull your fucking channel. Or, um, just like a couple other people that I want their channel down. I can also give them your name as well and put your name on the roster. So, getting off of Juggalo YouTube roster. Okay. You can get a roll cast on waiting for your videos. Because I will thumbs them all down, you fuck. How does it feel to be a bunch of hypocrites? Does it feel good? It's almost like real family, isn't it? You know, you say to something, oh yeah, I love you, but you really don't. Um, yeah, sure, I'll come pick you up, but you really don't want to. Americans are selfish. Fucking selfish. And not only that, we live in a world where um, people only listen to 10% of a full story and they think they know it all. Right, McCormick? Right, um, black dude? Right, um, Mr. Whitey's back? Right, Mr. McEnhoe's? You have guys have turned your back on the fam. Me being one of them. I wonder how that's going to sit with everybody else. Um, I can be a conspiracy motherfucker for the next week if you like, but I'd rather continue just to do my normal videos. But I will not do my normal videos until... I see reparations. Reparations, one being from the black guy. He owes me $5,000, but he doesn't have to give it to me now until my lawyer officially sends him the letter that he's being sued and he has to go to Arizona court. I hope he can afford a plane ticket. I hope he can afford a plane ticket back. I hope he can afford his lawyer's fees, and I hope he can afford my lawyer because my lawyer is on retainer, but he's still going to want something. And, um,. If I win the case, you're the one who has to pay for them. So, people really, 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 really need to think about things. Especially black people. Because they're almost like Italians in a way. We say a lot of shit, and we, we're not weighing the consequences. Like, I say a lot of shit, and I don't weigh the consequences. The same as a black guy. What a coincidence. You know what I'm saying? I really, really want jail to open. I'm fucking waiting. Just need to spread the word to my people. And we'll see how long your fucking channel stays up. You better prick. I'm sorry. You better prick. You probably don't understand I talk kind of quick sometimes as the well butrin. You're gonna pay. 
You can send 16 juggalos at me. You can send 1,600. What makes you think you're going to send 1,600 when you neglected those 1,600 and chose 16 people who you think is good enough for you? Because they kiss your ass good enough. So, you know what? It's good that you have 16 buddies now, but you may have a lot more enemies because of what you did. Me being one of them, fat boy. Mr. Lucky Sinner, I know you're watching my videos. You need to give the information that I requested. Okay? Mr. Mackinhoes and Strictly for Diggalos. Fuck it, get a loud cast. I want these three motherfuckers' info. I want all their info. And I know you can get it. You know I can get it too. Which is why I'm asking you for a favor. Do me a favor, and I'll do you a favor. I'm sorry guys that I'm using my Charles Manson manipulation skills. But, um, I am that kind of person. I am not a, I don't know, closet juggalo? Is that what you want to call it? I'm, dude, you talk shit to me, I'm a slice ya. You fuck with me, I'm a hack ya. You disrespect me, I'm a punch you. That's just how I am. I'm off probation in six months, guys. You guys might want to keep your videos very respectful. Because I won't take a plane. I'll take a train. In a train, you're allowed to bring stuff. Chemicals. Shit like that. Plane, no fucking way. <clears throat> so, I'm waiting for video responses from you fucking fruitcakes. And I don't know how the fuck you talk to Twisted Girl when she makes a video, one video a month. Hmm? Stupid. So you guys put a title up and people are like, whoa, it's a pretty good title. Maybe the video is okay. Um, no, the videos suck. Fact of life. And Big Irish, I don't know what the fuck I did to you to make you hate me, but I don't know what else to say besides fuck you. I really don't, dude. Um, I'm t I'm so fucking confused right now, dude. Where my fucking pills? I'm so fucking confused between all you guys. Um, I really don't know what the fuck to do, motherfuckers. What, motherfucker? I don't know what to do, Irish. I'm getting the impression that you don't like me. You're getting fed up of me. You are a grown up. What I want you to do is get on motherfucking YouTube and tell me, Danny, go fuck yourself. And I promise I will leave you alone. Promise. I wanted to do the video for you on what's the most important thing in my life. What what means the most to me. And I'm getting emotional just talking about it. What means the most to me is this little hat that my mom sewed for me when I was in an incubator, when I died three times, and they brought me back to life. The hat that they put on me was causing me to suffocate. So my mom sewed me a hat.
but I can't find it. It's somewhere. I know I have it. I've had it for the last fucking 31 years. The heck? It just reminds me of how lucky I am to be living. And when my mom was sleeping on the floor in the hospital, she would be woken up like every fucking 15 minutes because my heart would give up. blue, I mean Irish. I I wish I could find the hat. He probably wouldn't even be able to fit over this bottle. That's how small it is. It's a green hat. It was knitted perfectly. The first piece of clothing I ever put on my body was a piece of green clothing. And I've loved green ever since. Um, I don't give a fuck if you guys laugh at me. I don't give a fuck. What do you guys do? Every time I talk about this, it it gets me upset. And it gets me aggravated. Why didn't you just die when I was a kid? But that's what that thought gives me. Every time I think about that, I have. Why the fuck am I here? I just think sometimes things would be better if I wasn't here.